Sirius XM. <laughs> What's happening, YouTube? It's your girl Slim from A Bar Imaging. Hoping everybody is doing well, staying healthy, and socializing responsibly. And you know what that means? That means wearing masks. Now, I don't have on a mask because I am indoors. However, our vlog two today and our first unboxing has to do with masks. Now, I know a lot of you are probably on the fence about wearing face masks, but it is a necessary thing right now until we all can get rid of this cloud called COVID from hanging over us. Now, as they call it, the new norm has invaded our space. We have to accommodate those who have asked for custom face masks. And we reluctantly got into the creation of these custom face masks, but the demand was there. And so now, while we were doing it via heat press or our hat press, we had to keep up with bigger orders that are coming down the pike. And so we decided, why not? Now today, we got a surprise for you. My husband, that guy, that's what I nicknamed him because you never see his face, will be doing this unboxing for you all. And what did we receive? Well, from Action Engineering, we got our first screen print platen mask for custom masks. Like, say that three or four times. Let's take a look at the masks that we used in order to do these customizations. And let's take a look at the box. Let's get it. As you all know, there are different styles of face masks out there on the market. These are just three of the ones that we've used here at Aidball Imaging for our clients and customization. We have what I like to call the surgical face mask, the kind that you tie on the top of your head and the back of your neck. Then there is the pleated one, where a lot of people prefer this one because it's not so flush to their face and a lot of people have like claustrophobic issues. But as far as the customization is concerned, it's a little bit more intricate because you can only do it on either side. This big crease right here kind of makes it difficult to customize. The main one and the most universal and also works for our screen print platen is the flat one. Now there's a lot of different uh, brands out there. This happens to be a tall text one and uh, we have used this one and a lot of people really like this one in particular because it is more flexible and again it does fit our platen. So let's go take a look at our platen and see how this particular face mask works with it. engineering flat mask palette for this these face masks deal we got going on in the world today these are for the perfect for the ones that wear behind the ear frontal area it's five and three quarter by three and a quarter they say it's actually a little bit shorter than that I suggest that you wipe off this edge here before you start printing your first face mask because it will leave a powdered mark around your face mask. In that sense, it's not something I would want to give the customer that has another mark on it. It's something that's supposed to be clean. You don't need any glue. The palette itself holds the face mask down so that you have a nice tight, nice tight situation. It won't lift up. Well put together, very sturdy for the Hopkins press. This is a Hopkins style. We give it a thumbs up.
have it, our first unboxing of our face mask platen from Action Engineering. We're not getting any type of endorsements from any of the products that we review or that we unbox. We simply just like the quality that Action Engineering has. A lot of their platens fit whatever type of press that you have. And as for us, it fits our Riley Hopkins Jr. 6'4 just fine. And now you've also had a chance to at least somewhat get introduced to my husband and partner, that guy, or Roy, a man of minimal words. He talks a lot any other time though. He's gonna kill me for that. If you're a screen printer, you might look into getting a face mask platen for your press, or you may even be able to make your own. If that is the case, leave us some comments. Share your thoughts about this particular platen or the ones that you've used. We thank you for watching, and we hope that you found some knowledge and some entertainment in this vlog. Ring the notification bell, give us a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. We appreciate your time. Be great in your eight. Peace. Make sure you get my biscuits. Favorite platen places? No, we don't want to say favorite. <laughs> we got a screen print platen for, we got a, so what did we get in the mail? Well, we got a screen print. I love boxes. I love boxes. Reluctantly, we got into creating via our cat press. We are not getting any type of endorsement from Action Engineering, but it wouldn't hurt. No, I'm gonna say that.